Hello and welcome to Introduction to Bioinformatics Lab Course. Our topic is Phylogenetic Analysis using Phylip software. I suggest you to uh, visit this Bioinformatics Virtual Lab uh, on this uh, web link here and uh, you should follow these three tutorials over here these uh, tutorials will give you uh, information which you can write down in your practical notebooks if i follow the first one construction of claravan it leads uh, us to this uh, web page here and uh, you have uh, some keywords and theory about phylip program and importantly uh, the methods involved in phylip program so there are several uh, methods um, you can see here uh, like there are different methods such as tna ml tna dist secboot pro ml and pro dist we are going to use these different methods for phylogenetic analysis and uh, a bit about how to download this software just go to google and type in phylip it will lead to you on this web page and then you just uh, scroll down and go to get me phylip software here you scroll and you'll find it uh, that for windows where they have given two different programs so i suggest that you download this version which is 3.695 for windows and then you'll have some instructions how to install the program on windows so mainly we are using character based methods or distance based methods for uh, phylogenetic analysis so in character based methods uh, the aligned sequences for example the multiple sequence alignments are directly used for tree building or tree inferences while in distance based methods uh, the sequence data is uh, transformed into pairwise distance matrix such as this one and this matrix can be used for tree building so we have uh, different methods under distance based and character based methods so you have a upgma uh, fitch and margulyash method neighbor joining and in character base you have maximum parsimony and maximum likelihood for different methods uh, phylip software have uh, different programs uh, which can be used uh, in order to make use of these different methods so here is the uh, flow diagram which can, you can use for uh, phylogenetic analysis if you're dealing with the nucleotide sequence so under character based uh, method you have uh, this dna ml program and in distance based method you have dna dist program and this dna dist is joined with a another program which is known as neighbor uh, that is for neighbor joining method so it is important that you understand how is the workflow here so first of all uh, you will need a input file this input file can be in the form of a text document or uh, it should be in a file input file format so this input file is taken by uh, the dna ml program and uh, after processing it will give you two files one is out file and one is out tree file so the next step is that you rename this out tree file and uh, rename it with in tree uh, so that this out tree uh, becomes an input file for the next step which is uh, using drawgram or draw tree program for obtaining different type of phylogenetic trees drawgram is used for rooted tree and draw tree is used for unrooted tree formation similarly this input file is taken by dna dist uh, program in this under distance based method and it will give you uh, just one file which is named out file and you have to rename this out file as in file and then this in file is used as input for the next program which is neighbor and this processing step will give you out file and out tree files and once again you have to rename this out tree file into in tree file so this is input for the drawgram and it will give you a rooted tree 
uh, there are similar steps followed for uh, a protein sequence and uh, in this case uh, you have uh, different programs although so we'll be using secboot and proml programs under character based method and in distance based you can use uh, secboot prodist and uh, neighbor methods for phylogenetic analysis so we start uh, with input file in text form or a filelib input file format and this input file is given to setput it will give you out file and once again rename this out file as in file and this in file is uh, taken by the program proml and then uh, it will give you out file and out tree then rename this out tree as in tree and uh, give it to drawgram program and you will obtain rooted tree in distance based uh, the input file is given to setput first and then you will obtain out file this is again renamed into in file and then this in file is used by prodist and uh, you will obtain out file uh, rename the out file as in file in file is taken by the program neighbor and it will give you out file and out tree then rename this out tree uh, into in tree so use this in tree for tree building uh, by the program program and it will give you a rooted tree so in the next part we will uh, learn the practical how to perform the phylogenetic analysis by taking some uh, sequence alignment of the different uh, dna or protein sequences